Now, something looks like it's gone horribly wrong because what I was setting out to find was the equation of a chord, right? But unless I'm mistaken, what we found is the equation of the tangent. Do, do you see them? They're exactly the same equation. I've just changed noughts into ones or twos or that kind of thing. It's the same equation. Has something gone wrong? Well, let's think about this. Wake up. <laughs> I hate iOS 11. <laughs> For all the things I love about it, uh, I hate my inability to aim my finger. Uh, this is like, there we go. Let me make that a little, there we go. So here's my, um, here's my parabola, can you see it? There's my quarter contact. It's in black. Do you notice it there? And um, this is something your book can't do. As you move your point around, you just get different tangents which give, which give you a different chord of contact. Is that okay? Does that make sense? All right, now here's what I want you to notice, okay? What happens if I play around a little bit and like, I want you to look at your, your neighbor's um, chord of contact, okay? I want you to look at the chord of contact and I also want you to compare it to where their external point is. Okay, like I, all, I asked you all to pick a different external point. Some of you have probably picked an external point quite far from your parabola, and some of you have picked one that is quite close. Okay, I wonder if you notice any differences between them. Watch what happens when I take this guy, which is quite far away, and I'm going to bring it closer to the parabola now. Watch carefully. As I take this external point and I bring it in, see my blue and my orange tangents? Do you see them? Do you notice? that they're sort of getting closer and closer together. Now hold on, think about that for a second. Why are they getting closer and closer together? Hmm. Well, if your external point is closer to the parabola, then the other points you're in contact with are also getting closer. If the points are getting closer, their tangents will become more alike. Does that make sense? What happens if I keep going? What happens if I don't just make it closer, but if I actually take that external point and make it, let's see how accurate I can be, an internal point. Oh, I missed. I, I told you it would be hard. Let's try again. There we go. Uh, yeah. Use your imagination. I'm happy with that. That'll have to do. Okay. Now, what's going on? What's happening? Why are these equations, equations of tangents, equations of tangents, and equations of, like you would usually think of those as quite different objects, but thankfully, we're pretty well equipped to think about what happens when objects you think of as quite different become the same object. Do you remember? Write this guy down for me. Hmm? Do you remember this guy? Just be careful. Note what I've written and what I haven't written. What is that? This is a gradient, right? What's it the gradient of? Right now, right now, it's the gradient of a secant, right? Because look, here's a spot and here's another spot where there's uh, rise. Here is, there's run on the denominator, right? So this is actually this. Yeah, does that make sense? And then the x's cancel, okay? Currently, it's the gradient of a secant. How do I turn it into the gradient of a tangent? Okay, now it's a tangent. Now it's a tangent, okay? Now, oh. if we come back to all of this business, right? We actually have dealt with chords before. We just not dealt with these weirdo looking chords, okay? Does anyone remember what is the equation of a chord? It's not on the reference sheet, so you need to know this one. It starts with a half. Very good. Mm -hmm. uh, there's something here first. Someone help him out. That's, yeah, that's, this is the, yeah, okay, good. Minus APQ, yeah? Okay, now remember I told you as you move your external point closer and closer and closer, your tangents get more and more alike. In other words, these two things get closer and closer together. So in fact, this tangent 
turns into a chord, right? Or vice versa, actually. The this is the chord, sorry. Turns into the tangent, okay? And that's exactly what we observed. I'm not even going to pull down the screen anymore because I'm lazy. Uh, that's exactly what we observed here, okay? As your tangent uh, tangents get closer and closer together, they cease to become two different objects and then they're just, that was a good one, uh, then they're just a tangent, okay? So on the reference sheet, you will find two formulas. One for the equation of a tangent. And then the other one for the equation of the quarter contact. This is one that's on the reference sheet. And they're the same formula because they're the same object. The difference is just a limit. Okay, 